this holds most universally accepted and the most common syringes on the market, all the way from about a quarter inch in needle length all the way up to an inch and a half or 40 millimeters if that's in metric. So we have some, a one mil glass BD syringe. This is a one mil insulin syringe, a half mil insulin syringe. This is a one mil BD, Becton Dickinson. And this is just a, probably the most common lure lock type syringe that you'll find. Why is this the most common? Well, because they are very cheap. So most people use these ones. And so ones that we use in the clinic also, because we are giving hundreds and hundreds of injections in clinic. They still work really well. We like the lure lock because of the ease of interchanging different types of needles. And then still with a lot of HRT or hormone replacement therapy, testosterone patients, for some reason, they're still giving these big three mil syringes. So this is a syringe holder that we, we still include with the auto injector and then all the way up to this big five mil and same thing. So let's say you have this, this three mil syringe and you need to swap out the syringe holder. Just hold the back of the device, pull it back. And then now take this, you can even put your syringe in there. Push it forward, make sure that it's in the slot and that's it. And now you can see approximately where that goes. Another commonly asked question is, they say, well, this does not go all the way to the very end. And that's a, because of the, the universal application, it can't be perfect for all, every single application. But as long as you are able to get into the, into the muscle for your injection, it's not gonna be an issue. So don't worry about that. Especially if you're using a one and a half inch needle, that's, that's, that's plenty long for any intramuscular injection. Many people use inch and a half needles. In clinic, we primarily use one inch for intramuscular injections in the glutes, in the quad for your bent glute, and then we will do a half inch needle for the deltoid injections. So.